Hi, I'm Dr. Hamid Jalilian. I'm a professor of otolaryngology and the director of otology and neurotology at UC Irvine. My role is to be in charge of the division that uh, deals with problems of the ear, including hearing and balance, as well as tumors around the ear and other chronic conditions of the ear. Today, I'm going to be talking about superior canal dehiscence. Superior canal dehiscence is a condition of the inner ear where the bone overlying the inner ear uh, between the brain coverings, the dura, and the inner ear erodes away. That causes various symptoms for the patients, including things like uh, hearing loss, patients hearing their own voice in their ear, patients hearing their own heartbeat or eye movement in the ear, dizziness with loud sounds, uh, or dizziness with uh, pressure in the ear. The treatment of this condition uh, involves surgery. Um, we have been unique in that we have found that a lot of patients with superior canal dehiscence also suffer from a condition uh, of migraine that involves the inner ear. And when we treat that migraine condition, many of the superior canal dehiscence symptoms go away. In a very small percentage of patients that need surgery, we're able to do the surgery from multiple different ways, either through a middle fossa, through the mastoid, or uh, with round window plugging. We have some of the earliest experience with the transmastoid approach, which prevents the need for the patients to stay in the hospital on all the complications associated with doing surgery around the brain.